As you can see here, we're just reminding you again that Cat Dennings died in season two. Just in case you needed to remember. But I've been told that I must talk about more things other than the Dennings. So this episode includes other things like here, Blob 2, where he's washing under his arms with paint. I don't think that's very hygienic. So here we go. Looking at the intro to a totally different game, if you would like to try painting a world that's been made to be black and white, which sounds absolutely horrible. It sounds so depressing. Ooh, and he looks like he's from a very nasty communist country. So that's bad. By the way, Let's get on with some more interesting things. Like the Dennings! And this is the young lad what is willing to be on our show. It's only taken a couple of generations, but we finally got there. Someone who's quite.
confident of being on the silver screen. So he's finally here. And as we've been waiting for his birthday to be old enough to be on the show. Because his parents didn't want to be. Hey, that's cheeky. Not he wasn't shy, but come on. So now we're going to go into movie releases. Because my boss says I have to talk about other things. So here we are. A very sad film called The Never Falling Down Movie. And that's all it's about, people. Just trying to stay on the edge and you just fall off. It just feels like the last couple of years. With the space virus. All just been on the edge for too long. So it's just sad we need more nice films. Things that are going to cheer us up. So like this. The Holiday. The Holiday Movie. On a big cruise ship. So, if you fancy going on holiday, they're all saying it's safe to book now, but I still don't trust it. Because I, I lost lots and lots of money um, booking a holiday and then the space virus came and ruined everything. It was just awful. So, I'm not going to risk it. I'm not going to go abroad. I'm going to stay right here. So, I don't know what you guys are going to do. Where do you fancy going after lockdowns? But let's face it people, we need a break! This cruise looks a bit boring. I can't see it's like a, a themed one. Well she's not going anywhere to show anything interesting. I mean they're not even sailing anywhere, it's still in port, wherever the port is. Come on, why, why is the pigs down there on a cruise ship? That's the food escape from the canteen. Oi, chefs! That's meant to be my breakfast. Come on, peoples. Capture them animals. Why ain't anything happening in this movie? It's not even like the bad, bad boat movie, Speed 2. Nothing's moving or going anywhere. I mean, there's all that energy coming out, but we're not moving. Come on, oh, this film just looks so boring. I know I'm not meant to be a movie critic, but come on. We're just going round and round and round and nothing else is moving. What are you doing all the way up there anyway? What's the plot of this film? There isn't even any dialect. Come on, is there a script? Is there a point to this? Hello? Oh, no, no, they're telling me not to talk about the dead ends all the time. Look at this, this film's boring, come on! What do you think, people? Is this a film you'd want to see? Comment below if you would see this movie. I know I wouldn't. Oh, it's just painful watching the trailer of it. Nothing's really happening. The most interesting thing is watching two little pigs on the poo deck. Well, now there's something else on the poo deck, but I can't tell what it is. Oh, it's a person! Finally! Someone's taken the Jack and Rose position. Oh, they've disappeared. Come on! I'm so bored. Finally, that torture is over with. So we're finally going to see, hopefully, a more interesting movie. And it's the sequel of Don't Ring My Bell, the sequel to Ring My Bell. Yeah, see if you remember it people, it was out a couple of years ago. And is it any funnier this one? Cause that's what they do with Ring a Bell and pranking all the time. So, I don't know. Just have to wait and see if it's going to be good. So now let's get on with some more movies. Because obviously my bosses are telling me I can't keep talking about the Dennings. Alright, so... Again, the sequel, more clips of the sequel. I suppose this is more interesting than the boat one. At least it's kind of funny. <coughs> They're even destroying the bell! You won't have a bell to ring. I can't see this becoming a trilogy. No. I think the joke's been done far too much. So here we are. 
I've been told I'm allowed to talk about Denim, so sorry, there's gonna be more movies to talk about for now. And this one is a is Bed Wars. Yes, the movie Bed Wars, you heard me right. And an interesting fact, it shares the same studio as the Fallen movie. Because everybody's trying to save money these days. So everybody's using the same Oh, I'm our new cameraman, do you mind? Why are you filming back of my head? And here's the other film that's come out. It's called The Holiday List. So it's all the things of what you're going on holiday for. Bring out too many holiday films. Yes, we know. You want us all back on planes and pain to go here, there and everywhere. But we don't want to get stuck in other countries, do we? You know what I mean? Well, obviously, you're going to read a book on the plane. You're going to go that far. Don't forget your, your headset if you like the in-flight movie. Hoping it's not one of these. Really hope it's not that boat movie. That was so boring still. Ugh. And here we are, finally getting to a horror sci-fi movie. The Culver Experiment. This should be a lot more interesting than the others, because there's a lot more actors and actresses in it. So that's a good start. And something's finally happening, people. Ooh. I don't know what's happening, but it looks interesting. So this poor person is being experimented on, and they're trapped in a corner. So what's going to happen? Is it going to be like radioactive spiders? Radiating monkeys? What? 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 What's happening? Is it super power movie? Cool, let's face it, we've had a lot of them lately. Nope, still, still not giving us any clues. Why are these trailers so long? Come on, what's happening? Well, I don't know what are you going to turn into? What are you going to become? Is it a good person? Is it a bad guy? What's happening? It's quite worrying. Because this person is in diamond armor. So... Oh, so there is spiders in it. So these are the radioactive kind. And we're going to have like a new Spider-Man movie. No? Yes? Or oh, we're looking at arachnophobia here. I'm sorry people, nobody told me what this film is about. I'm having to guess, y'all guess is as good as mine. Right, so he's killed the spider, so he's not in... He's not, like, helping the spiders. Are you making, like, uh, what kind of experiment is this? Then use this one for free without any cost. Uh, why is there a hole in the ground? Let's announce our audience experience. Oh, this one doesn't make any sense either. Is there any good films this year? Come on, people! Oh! What's happening now? Oh, I suppose things are happening. And now we've got a really sad cat movie. So if you if you're a cat fan, Please look away. Apparently this is a very disturbing movie for feline lovers. I don't know why, yet. it's just a house full of cats. <gasps> no! Somebody threw a kitten into the fire! That's just awful! That person tried to get it out and died as well! Oh, this film is horrible! I don't like horrors. They're just awful. Why does anybody want to watch them? Why, why, why watch scary things? We've got enough scary things. We've got wars going on. We've got electric and gas bills that are going sky high. We've got enough things to be afraid of. Why do we need to add fictional fears on top of everything? I want, I want some interesting movies. That are nice. I'm gonna cheer us all up, but not a horror. But at least something's happening in this, but it's still not nice. No. Oh, that's cute though. Oh, little snuggly kitty. See, the ending weren't bad. Presuming that was the ending. Oh, people, let's see the Happy Cat movie! Finally! Something decent to watch. Yeah, I really wanna see this. 
this will cheer me up because that's what the internet needs people it needs more cats on it we've got a shortage of cats on the internet would you agree i would especially one with top hats on and now we've got the too fast too pixelated movie 6000 i wish this franchise would please just end it's just getting sillier and sillier and sillier. And all of you going on about, yeah, we can drive with our family. Yes, we get it. You've got like this big family that you're not related to. Because you drive around in cars. That do crazy things. That's not realistic. Oh, I just can't believe it's still going. We need, we need these cars. What are going to drive for us? I think this is the only thing that's going to kill this franchise. I don't even know how it became a franchise. I don't even know how it got past movie one. Come on, people. I'm blaming the boys. I think all these boys are going to see these movies. I think they're all pretending they're little again and they're playing with toy cars. Well, that's what I think what's keeping it going. All these children want them to play on big boys. Want to play around with cars, but they're too old for it, so they watch these movies instead. Come on, they're running out of vehicles now. They're even doing tractors. Seriously, they're doing a drag race with a tractor and what looks like a golfing cart. I mean, come on, people, steer properly. Oh, these movies are just getting sillier and sillier. Oh, why? Why? This is just awful. Come on, can we just get back to talking about the Dennings? This is just ridiculous and movies are so boring. A snowboarding movie. See, this is more like it. See, like some nice, beautiful locations. And something that actually requires skill. Not something that makes up flying cars or can be driven with remote controls. Go on, let's see a race. See, this is more like it. See, oh no. It's just full of so much snow. Well, what movie are we going to see next? Yep, I'm not really interested in many of these. I'm only like the Happy Cat movie. Oh no! It's too fast and too pixelated 6001. Seriously, how quick do they make these car movies? Come on, people. This is ridiculous. We don't need such a terrible car franchise movie. Oh, one of these self-driving cars coming so this franchise can finally end. Oh, it's just painful. And you know how many women? I think these are revenge movies on women. You know, like when you take men to the mall when we go shopping or we leave them bored. I thought they'd bring out this franchise so that boys and men can take us to the cinema and watch these boring driving movies. Come on, why waste your time? Just let me drive my own car. Let's go and do something interesting. Not watching tractor racing against a golf car. Come on. Oh, at least the early ones, at least it was quick vehicle. But now it's good getting slower and stupid. Because we're running out of ideas. They're going to have a Tin Lizzy next. The very first car. Oh, I think even that'll be quicker than this tractor. 
Ugh. Come on, boss, let me talk about the Dennings! This is so boring! Boring! They're not even changing locations anymore! It's just getting so lazy! Just watching people drive! Oh, please, can we please put a different film on now? Oh, even better, talk about the Dennings! Oh, come on! I'm so bored! What about our poor viewers? I don't think they want to watch this! Oh, D! No! No, they want to come on here for. They're here for the Dennings. They're not here for the movies all the time. Yeah, I know it's a shorter episode, but I don't care. I want to talk about the Dennings. We've been waiting long enough. And especially with all these boring movies that are out. We need good YouTube videos. But let's face it, the movies look naff this year. They look terrible. There's only like one movie I want to go see so far. Oh, come on, peeps! Hurry up and end! trailer end already! Finally! Thank you! Everyone was so bored of that, it's terrible! So now, we're going back to the snowboard movie. Look how much more interesting this is. Things are happening. Things are quick. Ish. Oh, there we go. Now the race begins. Yes, we know it's snowboarding race. We know what it is. We literally don't need it spelling out for us, we know what the movie is about. We all know the plot, there's gonna be like two people who've got beef with each other, and in the end they'll become best friends at the end. Because they're both good at snowboarding, and why wouldn't you get on with someone else who likes the same things you do? I mean, it's a bit of a no-brainer, isn't it, really? So, yeah. I'll probably ruin the whole movie if not, but there we go. So, we're clearly in the racing part at the moment. Oh, Jim, I'm looking quite close. This is way more interesting. This is a lot better. This is more, more, more interesting racing rather than having four wheels. Instead, they just have a plank of wood or whatever the boards are made out of. So, we're just going down a hill. Really, really, really fast. Oh, come on, boss. Can't we get back to the Dennings now? I've proven I can talk about other things, but it's just not as interesting. I'm trying. Come on. Oh, more snow. Oh, at least it's a penguin. Oh, yay, to the finishing line. Yay! Hopefully this trailer's done as well, so we can get back to interesting things like the Dennings. Oh no, they're going back up the hill on the lift and it's all gonna start all over again. No! I know it's a pretty place, but I wouldn't want to be there, it's too slippy. Oh, here we go again, another race. Really? How long do these trailers have to be? We've seen like half the movie by now. Yes, we 
know it's snowboard racing, why do they have to spell it out for us again? We know nothing's changed, it's like he's changed to skis or something, he's still doing it on a board! Oh, come on, movie! Seriously? Oh no, people are getting seriously hurt in this. This must, film must be for 18 and over. So please avert your eyes if you're younger, because that was just horrible. No. No, I didn't realize it was that kind of film. Please tell my boss we need the Denims back. And sponsored adverts. That wasn't a good one. So please ring the notification bell. Goodbye! Oh, typical. They put the exciting car movie at the end of the video. What were they thinking? This looks like a much better franchise. The next one looks like the red and black scarred superhero. Yeah, that was frightening. Okay, it's goodbye for real now. Bye-bye!